Alright guys, I'm back with another video, of course, obviously, because what else am I going to do than post videos on my YouTube channel? But, okay, so today my video is going to be a PR unboxing. I woke up from a nap yesterday and I had a huge package in the mail from Lancome. And the previous backstory on this is me and my sister went to China and Korea, like, probably like a month ago. And we went with Lancome. I don't really know what exactly the trip there was, like, a... They had a new product they were unveiling, and so they had this whole like showroom and all this stuff that we saw. It was really, really cool. Um, but so yeah, they sent me this huge package in the mail. It's literally so heavy. It's literally so heavy. It's literally so heavy. So big. It looks like this. It says Lancome. Paris. Because I guess that's where they're based out of. But it's freaking huge for one. All right. So, I'm just going to jump right into it because I feel like there's a lot of products in here and I want to show you as much as I can. I'm going to swatch some stuff. Alright, so let's go. Okay, so there's a letter in here. You just got a letter. I wonder who it's from. And it says Sila. It says, Sila, we hope you had the best birthday ever. Here are a few goodies as promised. We hope you love. Best of luck in your next year at school, XO, Erin and Anna. So when we went on this trip, there was two of their PR girls, Erin um, and Anna, and they were literally the coolest girls. Um, we spent like probably like a week with them. We just did a bunch of stuff. We would go around China and Korea. We ate with them like every night dinner, and we went to these events. So kind of spent a lot of time together, and they were the nicest people. Um, but so yeah, they sent this to me, and my birthday was like, a month ago whenever I was actually on the trip I left the trip and then the next day when I got back to LA it was my birthday so it just turned 19 not too long ago which was pretty cool so okay so in this box it's set up so perfectly I swear don't know how they fit all of this in here but we have some eyeliners and waterproof mascara and volumizing mascara I'm going to open a bunch of stuff up, but I'm going to just, like, go through it first. We have, um, coal eyeliners or mascaras. We have a foam cleansing makeup remover with honey. I'm super excited to try this because I feel like we'll have so many benefits. Um, actually, one of my best friends works at Belk in our mall, and she opens up, like, all the products to put them in, like, Lancome, MAC, and all of the high-end makeup products. So she, when I showed her, she says... Oh my gosh, that stuff is really good. We also have metallic lip liqueurs. We have hydrating lip colors. We have cushion foundations, which I literally love cushion foundations. I've only used the Maybelline ones, but I guess this is like what it's supposed to be modeled after and it's literally my favorite. We have stick foundations. We have highlighters, gotta love it contour and highlighting sticks. I'm super excited to try those. I've never actually had one, but I've seen them in videos before. Um, brow gels. This says it's an eye brightening all-in-one five shadow and liner palette, so I don't even know what this looks like. Um, but I'm excited to open up and see what is in there. There is a three color bronzing powder. We also have a Bi Facial Face. This is um, just like makeup remover and cleanser. Uh, I have a Garnier version of this, so I'm excited to try this because I really love that. I also got another one of these. Okay, this is literally the coolest stuff ever. When I was on this trip, they had this showroom and they were showing all these new products they were making and they have this product called Genifique. It's a youth activating concentrate and it literally, I don't know what it is, what is in it, but you put it on your face once a day and it literally just like makes your skin so like bright and glowing and feels great and it's specifically for they call it bad skin days so if you have like a couple days where you have like breakouts or anything like your skin's really dry you use this for like a month and it just like literally makes your skin perfect i don't know how but it's like some magical serum and i'm so glad i got another one because it's the best stuff ever um they made a new one actually that you have like two things and you mix it together and I think it, this is this is the one and it's coming out in September I believe is what they said so you should probably get that because it's literally so awesome. Um, there's also an overnight mask. Ooh, cannot wait to try this. There is body butter. Oh my god. 
gosh, there's literally so much stuff. I just can't. Creams for dark circles, which is something that I have a really big problem with and I still have yet to figure out why. Some sunscreen. That's always good. You need to use sunscreen on your face all the time because sunscreen, it will help for later on because you'll end up getting wrinkles if you let the UV rays really affect you. So, um, there's some more volumizing mascara. Okay, so I'm going to open some of this stuff up and I'm going to swatch some stuff. If you guys want me to do a face full of this PR makeup that I got, I will. Just give this video a thumbs up. Um, but yeah, I'm going to swatch some stuff, so... I'll be right back after I open all of this up. I will show you guys what they look like and okay, yeah. All right, so I just um, separated everything out pretty much by what type of product it is. Um, so I guess I'll just start out with the first thing that I would do on my face, which would be like foundation. And so they gave a ultra wear makeup stick. All day color, wear and comfort, portable perfection soft matte finish for all skin types. This is in the shade 370. They also gave me two other ones, but I feel like 370 is the most similar to my skin tone. So I'm just going to open this up. Oh. All right. Um, it has sunscreen, SPF 21. Uh, it looks like this. I think just like your typical makeup stick. Okay, so I'm just going to swatch this on the back of my hand so we can see what it looks like. I don't know, I guess that would be very similar to my skin tone. Um, it has a very similar texture to, I've used the Anastasia uh, Beverly Hills stick foundation, and that's what it reminds me of. It has a very nice, like, a blendable, very easy, you can not even tell that it's on my skin anymore, which is obviously good. I cannot wait to try this. The next foundation they also gave me is the cushion and this has SPF 50 cushion compact long wearing high coverage makeup oil free it has like four dots for the coverage and this is in the state 380 um but it comes in like this box and there's two things I guess there's like the cushion and then the compact so I'm just gonna put it together I guess long wear high cover makeup refill I guess you can buy these separate and put them in there, so I guess we're just gonna open it up. Um, there's just like a little, there's a sponge, and looks like that. I guess you just gotta use it and get the makeup pumping in there, but I guess you just open this up and slide it in there somehow. Okay, just like that. We got it, it's good. I actually have one of these that they gave me in whenever I was actually on the trip. They gave me a PR package, and there's this one. Uh, they're different, but this is the light coverage version of this. But this okay, so for the next product that I would use on my face, probably be concealer. And they gave me um, color correcting ones. So they gave me a peach one, a yellow one, a green one, and a lavender one, which are all just for like certain tones to cancel out. And then they gave me just regular ones. I'm just gonna open up the regular one and one of the colored ones. So this one is 360 and this is just their Ultra Wear Camouflage Ultra Wear High Coverage Concealer and I've heard so many great things about this. Um, I guess it's supposed to be very highly rated and it's just in this little package like so and I'm just going to put a little bit on my finger and then put it on my hand. Ooh, it's very thick. So uh, I don't know how I feel about that because I don't like to have the cakey feeling, but I'm just going to rub it in, and we'll see. So, can't really, I mean, you can kind of tell a little bit, but that's obviously because it's not my skin tone. Um, it's kind of like a little sticky, but I feel like if you set it, it would be unnoticeable. I'm going to open up this peach, and it's Ultra Wear Camouflage, Ultra Wear High Coverage Corrector, which I guess that's what the other thing was, but... I usually use peach because I always have dark circles, like I said in my last video. It's the same, like, tubing, packaging, everything. Let's see what the color is like and the feel. I'm going to assume it's pretty similar. Let's put it... Yeah. They have about the same, like, feel to them. This is what it looks like. It's pretty good for the color, I would say. I would definitely probably use this because I do use the under eye 
concealer in peach. Okay, so next, after I would do concealer, I would probably do like contouring and highlighting. So they gave me these contour sticks, which have contour and highlight. This is buff, this door. I don't really know what the difference is, so I'm just gonna open this one color and test it out, see what it looks like. It is contour and highlight stick, and it looks like so. This is the contouring end, and that's what the contour looks like, and just do a little... I feel like that's a good shade, it's not too dark. And then this is the highlight. It's a shimmery highlight, not like a concealer highlight, and we're just gonna swatch that next to it. You can see the highlight. It's nice. They also gave me a bronzer palette, and so I'll just open that up since it's part of like contouring, I guess. Let's see. It is three color bronzing powder, bronzer, blush, and highlight. So I guess this is similar. It's the, there's three steps. First step is bronzer, second step is blush, and third step is highlighter. They are a little bit sparkly, which is not something that I usually use, but um, this is the bronzer. Honestly, can't tell, I'll just use my finger. It's very light. Can't really see it. That's next to the contouring stick. This is the blush. It's pretty pink. Can kind of see that. Focus in. And then this is the highlighter. It's a good shade. Um, I probably wouldn't really use the bronzer, but I definitely use the blush and the highlighter because these are good pigmented tones. All right. Next up, they gave me a brow. Um, styler. I'm gonna assume it's just like brow gel. So I'm gonna open up. This is in the shade Transparent, so it's just clear brow gel. Maybe there's another one. This is what it looks like. Styler. And that's clutch because I really enjoy using just clear brow gel. They also gave me one in Brun N. I guess this is Chitane, but this is the shade Brun. And it's just like a brown, I guess. Nice. Can't wait to try this because these, because I actually don't have any gel right now. I usually do use gel on my eyebrows just to set them in place because I swear they go everywhere. They gave me a bunch of different eyeliners. So this one is a bendable eyeliner, high precision, long wear, intense finish, smudge proof. And this is silver. Interesting. I just picked up a random one. But... Okay, let's see. How do you work this? It's literally like, I don't know how to twist it off. Okay, there we go. So I guess you can, I don't know, let's swatch it. I guess it like bends, like this part moves. So then you can get a good like, that's the color. I feel like that would be cool. You could do some ice princess looks with this. They also gave me a black one of that and a brown one. I really actually do enjoy using brown eyeliner because I don't like the really dark look because I never usually wear eyeliner. So what I do, I don't like it to be very intense. So that I'm looking forward to trying. Um, on there they have a picture of how you use the bendable um, handle or whatever. So that's interesting. I've never seen anything like that before. They also gave me a bunch of coal eyeliners, so they're eyeliner sticks. So I'm just gonna open this random one up. I'm not sure what shade it is. This one happens to be green, but there's a bunch of different colors and it's just like a regular eyeliner stick. Pretty creamy. I would definitely have to know what the consistency was like before I could use it. Okay, lastly on the eyes is mascara, and they gave me a bunch of different types. They gave me waterproof, super enhancing. This is a base, so I guess it's like a primer. And then there's an instant full body volume mascara, and then there's a uh, wide angle fan effect mascara, extreme hold, and this one's in waterproof, and then there's one that isn't in waterproof, and then they also gave me a big volume all day wear. I have one of these I gave because they gave us a little package while we were there, so I have a couple of products, like a few makeup products, but not that many. Um, I have one of these actually, so I'm going to open up this Custom Wear Volume Mascara, and this is a waterproof one. Um, it looks like so. And the brush looks like just your basic, I feel like, but can still give you lots of great volume. And it's waterproof, so you can wear it in the pool, you can cry. 
Uh, this one is the wide angle extreme volume up to 24 hour wear. This is an interesting bottle. I've never seen anything like this for mascara. It's actually so cool though. Look at the Lancome flower. Okay, interesting. I'm actually really excited to try this out because I've never seen anything like this before. Side note with the flowers. When we were in um, China, they had a like event slash showroom and there was so many roses. I've literally never seen this many roses in my entire life. I swear they took all of the roses out of China. It was so beautiful. They had a um, the O in Lancome with the accent over the top. They had it made out of flowers and you could stand underneath it. It was the coolest thing. There was flowers everywhere and they, they were real and it was so beautiful. Okay, so there's two more like types of products I guess left. Uh, they gave me a bunch of different lip colors, so I'm going to swatch those. Okay, so they gave me a bunch of metallic lip colors, and this one is in orange. I just picked up a random one, so. This is the, um, I don't know if it's uh, like a liquid lip-like type or what, but, or gloss. I'm just going to swatch this on the back of my hand. This is what it looks like, and that's the shade. They also gave me this hydrating shaping lip color, and this is in cream. This is the shade. Uh, with these, I guess it's a lipstick. And you press the top of it, and the bottom comes out, and you pull it off. And this is a brown. And this is what it looks like. There, um, it says it's hydrating, so it's not really, it's kind of translucent, but that's cool. While I was there on this trip, they gave me a bunch of lipsticks, actually, and they happened to have my name on them. I'll show you some of them. This, similar to the ones that are just like this, where you press it and it pops out and you pull it off. Um, but these ones have my name on them, which is literally so cool. There we go. See? It was the coolest thing. I don't know. It was a great experience to go on this trip because we were so immersed in the culture. We ate at all these places that were not places that tourists would eat at. We would eat at places that native like local people that lived in these countries would eat and so we got like a great idea of the culture it was pretty cool lastly the thing that everybody loves highlighters so they gave me five different ones and this one is the shade rose gold and the package looks like this and it says it's a dual finish highlighter multitasking illuminating powder all day wear um i'm just gonna swatch this this is what it looks like. Dang. That highlight though. Okay, I'm just gonna swatch this on the back of my hand. Let me show you guys. Wow. This highlight is popping. So I'll probably end up doing a review of a bunch of products that I'll try. I'm definitely gonna do a video of a face full of this PR makeup that I got because I pretty much got literally every single thing that you can use on your face, concealer, primer, highlighter, mascara, foundation, everything. So I will definitely do a tutorial or like a look of that, um, as well as a skincare video because they gave me so much stuff for your skin. I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, love you guys so much. Comment your feedback because I really appreciate it and give this video a thumbs up only if you liked it and also hit the subscribe button below so that you can be notified when I post new videos so you can see and be updated on everything that's going on. Lancome, I just want to say thank you so much for giving me the opportunity to go on that trip to Korea and China and I also just want to say thank you for all of these awesome gifts. I cannot wait to try them all.